What's up, guys? Welcome back. I just got off of work, and I was thinking of a video to make. I'm sorry I missed it last week. I just had a lot of stuff going on, but a lot of people have been asking me, how do you start on eBay? How much money do you need to start since it's a business, and obviously you're selling uh, items to make profit out of them? So a lot of people are in the um, mindset that you need a lot of money to start. And or, or every time I talk to them about eBay, they think I'm trying to scam them into something or buying something or a course or whatever no i'm here to tell you the only reason why i love ebay so much and i like it a lot and i feel like it's a great business to start because you you, you do get to learn a lot about logistics shipping how to make profit fees so you you need to start from scratch basically if you are new if you never sold anything in your life this is a good thing to do just to start and you don't need any investment. eBay does not charge people unless you choose a store. But obviously, if you're starting, you want to do it without the monthly subscription, which is absolutely free. It's actually free to even list your items on eBay. And then you just pay a fee once you, you sell them. But I'll get into that in a different video. But this video is it's made for people who are just starting, who are beginners. eBay, they never sold anything. And this is the first time they're um, ready to list something on eBay like I said you don't need an investment at all and actually I think the best way to start it's to start from items from your own home so that way you know how it works you know how the shipping process works how to buy shipping labels you basically know your item already because it's yours so you know if it works perfectly if there's some um, flaws in it like maybe if you're selling something that's scratched or there um, that has some little details that you know because it's your item so it's a great way to get your foot in the door to to start with your own items in your own home and there's many to be found for example I'm just gonna give you a quick example in my home right now I'm not selling this but this is a great thing if you're starting like let's say I was starting today I have a display here and these are the things that I don't really use I just I just have them to just to have them to display them but let's just say I'm, I want to start on eBay, right? Well, I have this doll that is, is, there's literally no use for me. I, I just have it for display here, but it's brand new. It's never been opened before. It has a barcode. So what I do is I, I, I scan the barcode and it tells me how much it's been selling for, right? So then I post it. Um, I don't want to give you specific advice on what to post but i will suggest not to uh, start with anything heavy try to keep it under a pound uh, because as you will see once you learn and get a little bit more into it there's a lot of shipping fees especially if you're sending from coast to coast like i'm in new york right now and if you send to california which is the other side of the uh, of the country something that's heavier than one pound will cost you a lot of money so if I was to advise you on anything to start with, I would say keep it under one pound. It can be a doll, it can be a, a video game. I personally sell video games because they, they usually weigh like eight ounces, 10 ounces. I'll go into more detail in different videos, but I would suggest start with something less than a pound. The, first, the very first item that I sold on eBay was five pounds. And yes, you guessed it, I lost a lot of money. I don't care because it was a really, really good uh, learning experience. But if, you know, if, if I was to give a personal advice, I would say keep it under a pound. All right. So you can start with anything in your home. You can start with dolls. You can start with anything that you have that you don't use. Watches, for example. Uh, you can start with anything that you have at home. If you bought it, that means somebody else can buy it. And maybe they don't have access or they want to get it for cheaper. So they go on eBay and, and buy it used. Or if you have something new like this that you bought a long time ago, maybe you can start with that if you don't if you don't really find a use for it and you want to start already. You don't need to make any investment. All you need to do is take a good picture, write a good description of about the item that you have. Since you already own it, and if you own it for several years, you know exactly what, what to uh, tell in the description. So it's a great way to start. Start with your own home first. 
after you sell a couple of items, then you go to the, to the next level. But the first level should always be start at home. Start with what you have, which you can do right now. As you can, uh, as you're watching this video, you can start. You don't need to spend any money at all. And if you offer free shipping, you include it in your price, or you have people pay for the shipping. I'll go into more detail with the shipping and the free shipping uh, aspects of the business, but I will say start with free shipping because people filter people who, who offer free shipping, people who don't offer free shipping. So you will have more visibility if you offer free shipping. So I will say start with um, an item that's not heavy. Start with an item that it's in demand because if you if you try to sell something that people are not looking for then yeah it's gonna take you a month to, to sell it or even more maybe it doesn't sell at all so yeah you have to start with something that's popular that people are buying so look around your home and see what you can find maybe a video game is perfect a doll or anything anything that you that you think people might want and you look at the history and see if the item is selling or not you can start then you go to Walmart, you go to any uh, any store, and you buy a box that fits the item. You buy some wrapping paper, some newspapers. I like to do it the safe way, so I buy a lot of shrink, um, bubble wrap. I would suggest go to uh, Walmart and get some bubble wrap or anything, uh, a warehouse. Maybe sometimes they throw it out. So you ask the supervisor, do you have any shrink wrap or packages or boxes that you don't use? Please give them to me so I can reuse them. So that's if you don't want to spend anything on boxes, but you do need a box that's safe, that would not break uh, while on transit to the uh, destination. You do need a lot of bubble wrap, a lot of protection, just to minimize um, the actual item from being damaged. So you, you don't want to run into those problems. So you got to make sure that you, you pack it really well. So this is a little video of how to start like I said, you don't need any money whatsoever. You can start with what you have at home. So I hope you find this helpful. If you have any questions, please uh, just leave a comment down below. Anything that I can help with. This channel is, I'm not a master. I'm not a, an expert on eBay, but I'm on my way uh, to an intermediate uh, level, I would say. I, I, I It's not my full-time income, but I, I've been making a pretty decent side income and it's pretty steady for the last few months so i know a thing or two but this channel is for the, for those who are just looking to start with anything for the beginners like i said i'm not an expert but i'm learning a lot i'm reading a lot and i'm trying to to make a better business and to actually make it a full-time income maybe one day but as for now anything that i learn i want to transfer it to you and hopefully you find this helpful and maybe you can share with your friends. If you like this content, you can subscribe and you can uh, you can get to watch a lot more videos. So, you know, we can all learn together. Because I feel like uh, there's a lot of YouTube channels out there, but these are people that are already on, on eBay for years and they have advice, but it's really, really confusing. Uh, so this is for the very, very beginning into different levels as we as I put out videos. So thank you so much for watching. If you like the video and subscribe.